Now, take a look at these paintings and drawings, which are causing a bit of a stir in the art world. Some have even sold for thousands of pounds. Nothing unusual there, though these pictures were produced by the artist during his sleep. London artist Lee Hadwin has a strange nocturnal habit, as our entertainment's correspondent, Brenda Romanis, has been finding out. The work of artist Lee Hadwin, a broad range of graphic images produced not while beavering away in the studio during the day, but in his sleep. I started drawing at the age of four. Between four and five, I'd just get up in the middle of the night and start scribbling, uh, whether it be paper, the floorboards, the walls. So my parents just put that obviously down to sleepwalking, so did the doctors at the time. It was only until I reached probably around the age of 15 or 16 I started doing more intricate stuff. Or do you just wake up in the morning and lo and behold, you see that sitting there next to you or what? How did... As soon as I wake up, I know I've done something because I start getting the, the feeling of a migraine coming on, but it's, I don't have the visual recollection of what I've drawn. And then obviously I wake up and whatever I've drawn is there. Lee's friends have filmed his nocturnal creative episodes at his South Kensington flat, so we sought medical advice. What we're seeing is really the mind very, very active. Um, you tend to think of sleep as being very much a sort of a passive thing. But actually, while we're asleep, an awful lot of things happen. It's much more common for men to have what are called parasomnias. And those are things or activities that people do while they're asleep. So sleepwalking, sleep talking. Um, I've heard of people going and playing musical instruments in the middle of the night. Um, I know of someone who likes to take his duvet into his shower and actually shower with his duvet whilst fully asleep. Lee has been analysed several times by the Edinburgh Sleep Clinic and cannot paint while in a conscious state. In fact, he got a D in art at school, but he has produced over 200 pictures while asleep. Some art critics just say that it's not art because I'm not conscious. But everyone has their opinion. Some people love my work, some people don't. Well, Donald Trump apparently loved it enough to pay a five-figure sum for a piece. But Lee's ambition is to hold an exhibition in London. Brenda Manus, BBC London News.